So Nigel, um, obviously uh, looking forward to the City game, not long now. Um, firstly, what was, what was your reaction when you saw the fish list come out and uh, would you prefer to start with this te- type of test or you know, would you prefer to start with an easier test? Is there an easier test in the Premier League? <laughs> Listen, every game is going to be so competitive. It's The Manchester City game is a game we're really going to look forward to, we're going to relish. We're going to play the champions in their back garden. It's a yardstick for everybody. They'll be expected to win the game. Um, we're going to go there and give it everything we can to win the game ourselves. But you've got to be realistic with it as well, knowing that we are playing the champions um, on their home patch. Uh, but we're positive. We've just had two back-to-back promotions. We've got a great, strong, ambitious, hungry group of players who want to be the best. Uh, and a football club that wants to be the best. And what we've got to do is maybe look back to where we were a couple of years ago and we dreamed about the opportunity to play Manchester City or anybody in the Premier League. We've got it in the first game and then we look at the games that we're going to follow on quickly. We've got to play them at some stage in the season. So we should relish it, we should enjoy it, we should embrace the challenge that we're going to be faced with and go for it. So last season, uh, Swansea promoted last season, they kicked off their campaign in that city. They lost that game and went on to a very good season. Do you take any um, positive things from that uh, example? I think when you look at the, the three teams that were promoted last year from the Championship into the Premier League, all three teams stayed in the Premier League. It's a tough division, that was probably one of the first time that's ever happened. We've, uh, we've just had two back-to-back promotions, we're a, a team and a football club that over the last couple of years have been used to winning and we've got to keep that mentality going forward. If we go into the Premier League now and just sit back and think, oh we're, we're there now, we're in the Premier League and take our foot off the gas, then we're, there's only one negative outcome that's going to come about that. So we've got to be positive, we've got to keep pushing everybody, we've got to drive on, we've got to keep an ambition about everything that we do. Uh, we've got to embrace the challenge that are going to come our way, but we've got to be positive about it.